Hi, I'm Nicholas Hasem, the Secretary General's Special Representative and Head of the UN Peacekeeping Mission, UNMIS. United Nations Day marks the historic occasion when the organisation was founded in the wake of World War II. It's a chance for us to renew our commitment to the cause of global peace and security. My message today is for the citizens of South Sudan. This young nation is at a critical moment in its history as the clock ticks down to its first post-independence elections in December 2024, amid continuing conflict and escalating humanitarian needs. Despite these challenges, the UN family is working in partnership with the government and the people of South Sudan to protect civilians, build peace, and pave the way for sustainable development. UN humanitarian agencies are providing life-saving aid in the face of dwindling resources and threats to their own lives. We thank them for their courage in supporting the most vulnerable. But I'd like to emphasize that for this country to achieve its long overdue democratic transition, there must be a sense of urgency amongst its leaders and its communities to complete the peace process. International partners such as the UN can only play a supporting role. We do so by engaging with political actors at the national and state levels, reconciling feuding communities, helping the most vulnerable and advocating for sustainable peace. But ultimately it is South Sudan's leaders and its peoples who can determine their destiny by demonstrating common purpose and ensuring that every citizen is empowered to express their will freely in the upcoming polls. Since South Sudan proudly became a member of the UN in 2011, we have remained by the country's side on its journey from war to peace. Today I want to stress that it is time to conclude this journey and usher in a prosperous future. As the UN family, we continue to be your partners and thank communities for their unstinting support. Happy UN Day.